What is one of the major complaints that we hear about electric cars? Supposedly, they're ugly. In today's episode, though, we are not going to persuade you that the designs of the new models deserve to exist, but would rather suggest you to take a look at the fresh EVs inspired by the retro trends and electric conversions of the all-time classics. In today's video, electric propulsion meets the beauty of the past. Subscribe to Automotive Territory if you want to stay informed about the latest EV news and enjoy the ride! Honda e-Prototype The last year's urban EV concept was a widely acknowledged success on behalf of Honda that had showcased the future subcompact city commuter with intriguing retro design reminiscent of the first-generation Civic produced in the 1970s. Since then, the car has been greenlit for production and appeared in the form of an e-prototype at the Geneva Motor Show in 2019. The CV builds on the concept's ideas by stripping off futurism for practicality. It is now a five-door hatchback with conventional seats but the same face-like front fascia with perfectly round LED headlights, sleek interior lines and a modern cabin decorated with wooden elements. The WLTP cycle measures the range within 124 miles or 200 km on each charge with a fast 80% recharge time of 30 minutes. The interior tech package is rather impressive with wide screens spanning across the entire dashboard and it keeps on the essential analog controls. Aston Martin DB6 MK2 Volante The information that Aston Martin is actively working on electrification of their lineup has been in the news for quite some time now. There even have been teasers of the first production Repeat E. However, this sedan is not the only car model that constitutes the EV strategy of the brand. Since the interest towards the heritage models is all-time high, the Aston Martin Works division has been developing a unique first-of-its-kind reversible cassette powertrain. The initial retro model to be equipped with the stack is an original 1970 DB6 MK2 Volante convertible Grand Tourer. The electric unit is encased in a self-contained cell sitting on the original engine and gearbox mountings. Such a solution will help environmentally responsible collectors still enjoy their cars, but at the same time preserve the possibility to reverse to the authentic combustion plant. Chrysler Evex 910e Chrysler Electric is an Austrian high-tech company that was founded in 2014 by three brothers, Johann, Marcus and Philipp Chrysler. One of their most valued prototypes is EVEX 910e, which is a converted 1960 Porsche 910. This electric super sports automobile is perfectly tuned for extreme performance, just like the original, and shows unprecedented results. 0 to 60 acceleration time equals to 2.5 seconds, and the maximum velocity is limited only by the 186 mph mark. This Chrysler carries a 53kWh battery pack that, if we trusted the manufacturer, ensures 215 miles of range. The battery architecture supports 100kW charging, plus the car could be seamlessly integrated into your house's power grid to act as an energy source during peak hours. This electrified effects is an example of the return of EVs to beautiful classic designs with no compromises on performance. E-Roadster Intermechanica is a custom coach builder that specializes in the recreation of authentic speedsters and roadsters from the 1950s. In 2019, their DNS models are available with the electric powertrain, which was designed in cooperation with the corporate sibling Electromechanica. The new model received a name E Roadster and is a classic design of the Porsche Speedster, keeping the original style cockpit layout and beautiful handcrafted interior finished with light brown leather. The model is going to have tube steel chassis fully reinforced resin composite body, hood, trunk and doors, and a fully electric drivetrain. The vintage sports car is powered by a 50 kWh battery with decent 155 miles of uninterrupted driving, and due to the 250 pound-feet of immediate torque, it does 0-60 to 60 sprint in just 6 seconds. This is a dream car for any retro fan, but $125,000 price tag truly hurts. Mustang from Charge Cars The Charge Automotive is a London-based company that specializes in development of high-performance and luxury automobiles, and it has experience of working alongside Williams Formula One team, McLaren and Jaguar Land Rover. Their latest project is a limited edition of 499 brand-new electric 1960s Mustangs, both fastback and convertible. Created in cooperation with the recognized EV tech company Arrival, Michelin Tires, and Robo Race Platform. 
The officially licensed shells of the legendary Ford are mounted on the platform powered by 402 horsepower electric motor, which outputs 885 pound feet of instant torque and is coupled with a 64 kWh battery good for 125 miles of range. The charge is outrageously expensive, but since we shouldn't expect an official electric Mustang from Ford anytime soon, this might be the only option for the fans of classic muscle car design and electric propulsion. Peugeot E Legend This 2018 concept car from Peugeot presents the company's new vision of the future of automobiles as environmentally conscious and technologically advanced means of transportation. Both inside and out, the E Legend is inspired by the 504 Coupe, the brand's classic model from 1970s. It has a white windshield, a sharp silhouette, and signature lion claws head and taillights. Plus, the cabin holds luxury velvet upholstery paired with the Peldao wood upper parts, doorways, and panels, which are made from renewable forests. The concept also introduces an idea of an eye cockpit, which uses autonomous driving technology with four driving modes, a voice-activated assistant that speaks 17 languages and offers completely customizable infotainment for each passenger. And of course, this legend is all electric, with over 450 horses and 590 pound-feet of torque under the hood, a fast charge option, and a 370 miles range. If you want to support the electric revolution that is happening right now, make sure to watch this video till the very end and share with your friends. Moreover, consider checking out the suggested episodes in the description and information cards. Let's keep rolling! Retro EV Retro EV is a Finland-based company that aims to connect classic car design, feel and driving experience with the modern zero-emission technologies. The company offers electric transformation of original MG MGA roadsters produced between 1955 and 1962. 1972 Triumph GT6 MK3 Coupe, classic luxury Rolls-Royce Corniches, Silver Shadows, and finally Bentley Continentals, all of which are represented in convertible, coupe, and sedan body styles. All the vehicles are fitted with electric motors that vary between 134 and 230 horsepower and 215 and 370 pound-feet of torque. The smaller roadsters and coupes get 19 to 22 kilowatt hour batteries, while the larger models are equipped with 40 kilowatt hour packs, good for 78 to 93 miles on each charge. The company plans to release 50 cars within the limited edition series and accepts orders for 2019-2020 production years. Both turnkey vehicles as well as electric transformations for your existing classics are currently available. Luca EV Founded in 2015, the Czech startup called MW Motors wanted to create a lightweight electric car that would have a 185-mile range, would weigh less than 2,200 pounds, and cost under $25,000. Three years later, the company has managed to deliver on all of its promises but the price tag, which inflated to $34,200. The Luca EV unveiled in 2018 is a compact two-seater with a range of 186 miles. It has aluminum chassis and fiber-reinforced plastic body, its result weighing under 1,800 pounds. The car is equipped with four electric motors placed at the wheels, with the total output of 66 horses and the top speed of 90 miles per hour. The spark train is rather humble, but extremely efficient, requiring only 6.8 kWh of battery capacity per every 62 miles of range. The Look AV has a distinctive retro look, reminding us of the legendary Aston Martin DB4, Carmen Gia, and Mercedes Benz 190SL. Renovo Coupe Back in 2014, when electrification was just starting to gain the momentum, a California startup company, Renovo, managed to steal the attention of the market by building the first ever fully electric supercar. The model received a simple name, the Renovo Coupe, and it is based on the body of a classic 1965 Shelby Daytona. The chassis of the car is modernized, but its exterior remains relatively unchanged, keeping the iconic blue and white paint scheme and the long hood with the integrated air intakes. Under the hood, however, the car has an all-new powertrain as the old engine and transmission were swapped for a 500 electric motor that outputs around 1,000 pound-feet of torque. The coupe weighs 3,250 pounds, gets to 16 mph in mere 3.4 seconds, and develops the maximum speed of 124 mph. VW Bus ID 
Do you remember the iconic minibuses of 1960s, produced by Volkswagen and labeled Type 2, Transporter, Compi or simply the bus, depending on where the model was sold? Well, this legendary van is being brought to the 21st century in the form of the Buzz AD Microbus with a reminiscent retro design. This van has been officially confirmed and scheduled for production in 2022, both in the passenger and cargo hauling configurations. The bus sits on the modular electric drive kit XL platform with two motors on the front and rear axles. Each motor has output of 150 kilowatts and combined delivers 275 kilowatts or 369 horsepower. This allows Buzz ID to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 5 seconds and reach the top speed of 100 miles per hour and only one charge will take you 370 miles towards your destination. Do you agree that an electric conversion of a classic car is 10 times more beautiful than a modern EV? Or should we leave the past behind and transition to the futuristic designs? Share your thoughts in the comment section, watch suggested episodes on the screen, subscribe to Automotive Territory and support the EV revolution by sharing this video. As always, may the torque be with you!